What's going on boys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we about to go over the number one coin making method in Madden 23. If you're new to the channel and you enjoy the content, drop a thumbs up on the video, hit that red subscribe button. Let's get right into it. Let's go. Okay, so most fear has dropped. The number one way to make coins right now is to snipe and then re-roll the most fear, okay? But you wanna snipe at certain prices and you wanna have at least 24,000 training at a time up to about 35,000 training, okay? That's gonna give you a lot of rolls. Now, how you roll it is very, very important. In the re-rolls, there's going to be cards that stick because getting 78 overalls is something that happens a lot. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is when you come over here to the training, don't just sit there and let them eat up all your training with 20, 25, 78 overalls. OK, I've did this same method three different times. Number one, when you roll all your training, don't get more training and re-roll again. you got to let 45 minutes to an hour go in between. Now, I've had all successful rolls all three times so far, always over at least 100,000 profit or higher. Pulled the limited and a lot of 90s, okay? I've only pulled 192, but I've always pulled at least a 90 in each roll. Now, what I like to do is every time that I get an elite, I would do what I call the back out method, which is not looking at the pack. So what I mean by that is if I come over here to this pack right here, I would let the animation come in and then I would just back out. I would start spamming the back out button without seeing it. Every time that I get an elite. Now, every time I get a 78, I would go like this and go over the tabs. That's important during the rerolls so you can make sure that you are not getting the same thing eight times, 10 times, 15 times in a row. You want to be getting elites in between 84s, 87s, 90s. If you get lucky, some 92s, okay? Because with the training, you're going to get that super, super cheap. You're going to try to get it as close to 10 per as possible. And if you look at my binder right now, with all my extra trash, I was able to make an extra 90. I pulled a 90. I was able to make an extra 90 that I have up on the block right now. Now, these two cards right here. Out of all my training, I think I started off with about 28,000 training, is already gonna break even for me. Okay, I spent about 278 to 280,000 coins to get my training. And then these two right here, you can sell at the high end for about 192,000, but they are slowly dropping down. Okay, so about 182 times 182 is going to still give you around the break even margin and then from there you come down here i have this 84 this 84 this 84 this 84 and all these 78s is all profit okay all these you can sell for 2000 per so 2 4 6 8 10 12 on each row so 12 24 36 48 60 72 and so on okay so over a hundred thousand profit off of all these 78 overalls or once you break even you can come up in here you can take all these extra 84s and have free training all these 78 79 78 give yourself another easy seven eight nine ten thousand training once you quick sell everything it's all up to what you want to do once you break even or you get your coins back 
If you are smart, you would just take the profit, wait an hour, do the re-roll all over again. Like I said, the number one most important part of the re-roll is not letting yourself get stuck. So we're gonna go right here. We're gonna take some of these 78s just so I can show you in this video exactly how I roll, okay? So we're gonna come right here to these 78s and then I'm gonna show you video clips of how I roll also. So we're gonna take some of these 78s because we already made profit on this roll. So boom, there's 4,600 training right there, okay? So now we'll come right here to the marketplace. Always make sure that you use number one, the tab, and number two, when you pull an elite, do the back out method. I like to do it three times. So I will come up in here and tab over a couple times, okay? Now I've did this all three times and it is consistently helping me pull less 78s. But you're gonna be pulling some 78s. Don't get me wrong, you will be pulling 78s. So there's a 78. Tab over to the left, go back, okay? So you don't wanna pull the exact same card. If you see yourself pulling the exact same card, that's when you are in trouble. So we tab to the left, this time, boom, 78. It's a different card, tab to the right. Come back to training right here. You are looking for an elite. Once you get an elite, then you wanna do the back out method three to four different times. So another 78 right there, tab to the right, come over. You can even fake like you're gonna open up another pack. Trust me, there's a lot of 78s in here, but you will get elites sooner or later, okay? So you can come over here right here to the packs, go like this, go to no. That's another way that works. I just tried out a lot of methods to make sure that I'm not getting 78, 78, 78, 78, 78, okay? Five in a row 78s is something that will happen but as you can see 84 overall now what i'm going to do from there is i'm going to scroll around and now i'm not going to look for three times so once we get right there i'm going to back out okay i want that 84 overall to be a card that gets stuck i want to get duplicates of that it don't work every single time but sometimes you can pull two 90s in a row sometimes you can pull two 92s in a row it's going to take a little bit of luck we're going to go to our newest right here and 78, 84, and another 84. So another 84 did come out of the back out method, okay? So we got the 78s, we got the 84, then we did our three back outs, and we did get another 84. So the other 84 was in there, and that's exactly what you want. So you're gonna pull 78, 78, 78, 78, boom, 84. That's the type of pools that you want. 78, 78, 84, 78, 78, if the trim was going, it will be an 84, an 87, or a 90. That's how you want your pools to be, okay? Some of y'all are going to get lucky and pull 84, 84, 84, 84, 87, 90, 90. You know, it's going to all be depending on how the luck is. But this is going to give you the best chance of not having just 78 after 78 for about 10,000 worth of training. So the highest they selling for right now is 185,000, which is okay. One of them just sold for 200,000. So we're gonna try 193. It was okay, 193. I'm willing to take that. Hopefully that one sells. If y'all enjoyed it, drop a thumbs up on the video, hit the red subscribe button so you can always be notified. Gift cards will be throughout the next couple videos over the next couple days for all the love and support. Road to 12K, road to 15K, we are on it. Let's go.